Lucas Media. Wanted to sit on it for a day. I seen Puff release his video or Diddy, whatever y'all want to call him, on what happened with him putting his hands on Cassie. Now we all know that CNN leaked that video of um, him assaulting Cassie, which created so much outrage that he had to do a response. Let me play the audio, and then I'll come back with my thoughts. Cool to reflect on the darkest times in your life. Sometimes you gotta do that. I was fucked up. I mean, I hit rock bottom, but I make no excuses. My behavior on that video is inexcusable. I take full responsibility for my actions in that video. I'm disgusted. I was disgusted then when I did it. I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. I had to go into therapy. and go into rehab. Had to ask God for his mercy and grace. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But I'm committed to be a better man each and every day. I'm not asking for forgiveness. I'm truly sorry. So that was a Puff's or Diddy statement. Now, honestly, what Diddy did was foul, absolutely. And as far as the criticism and stuff, you can't really defend that. You know, I it was people like me out there that said, "Look, okay, we, we understand he got some some serious allegations against him, but we got to wait for the evidence to come out." And clearly, that did. But we're not gonna act like Diddy is the face of this horrible culture or when you when you think of um people who need to, to who need help you know the villain we're not just gonna keep using these brothers you know i again i'm not defending his actions at all but it's just funny that like the media will just rip and tear a black man apart just rip him to shreds even when he did make a mistake but you know the founder of us or the person who runs usc Smacks his wife and Stephen A. Smith goes on ESPN and ends up, you know, dancing and stuff and says, oh, well, you know, he made he made a mistake. And OK, well, what about this then? If you want to cancel Diddy, whatever, you know what I'm saying? That's fine. Whatever your opinion is. But we're not going to cancel Diddy. But then we got other people out here who have also been caught on camera and you give all these excuses for him. You know, oh, well, he's probably going through something, and, and I, I, I know Dana White for years, and, and okay, well, then, no, well, then, if we're going to do that, then we need to do, well, let me say this, we need to be the same way across the whole board. If we're going to cancel everybody, fine, but if, if, if we're not going to do that, then we're not going to pick and choose. Again, nobody's excusing Diddy's behavior, but it's just funny that whenever, you know, a brother does something, you know, that's a horrible mistake. He's the face of that mistake. No, no, no. We're not going to let that happen. So I just want to get my quick thoughts about it again. You know, I hope Diddy gets the help. He, the help. That was what? 2016. So like I said, hopefully he got the help he needs. And, you know, take your money, leave the country. Because <laughs> it, it didn't got hot for you. But no, listen, fine. If you, if you want to cancel him, fine. We need to cancel everybody. We need to drop some names. And if you're going to say no Diddy. Then we need to say no Dana and all these other people who you've seen do wild stuff on camera. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.